Hey guys, it's me, Patrick, and I'm back to the uh, game development. Now let's go back over our game, shall we? We're going to be in some more items, like armor and stuff like that. Added some uh, skills. Now let's add some armor. The basic set. Basic set. Oh, uh, armor. To that's the phone I want. And go up this one. Call it a standard garb. And we're gonna go with armor. Let's go with uh, body armor. And we're going to add defensive buttons. And uh, let's see here. So we're going to raise enhancement. Raises resistance. We're going to raise fire resistance by one. Maybe like five. And, um,. Bring a stat change. Attack power by one. And um, raise defense power by two. We have an enhanceable and um, we go with prices eight <laughs> points. And yeah, there we are. Now for our armor piece, we're gonna go with the ducky glasses, the Endra favorite. <laughs> Goes on the head. Enhances magical power by like mm, two. Eh, better make that with three, five, five. Enhances, enhances magical power by five. This price will be fifteen. Enhances that. Yellow. And we're going to add uh, one more item for armor. The regen ring or life ring. Set to regenerate. The uh, vital energies of the wear. This isn't so hard to do. We go over here, advanced settings, common event. We're going to call this regen. I'll regenerate one hit point every time you walk around. If you hear any barking, that's just my little annoying dog, Frankie. She doesn't like anything passing by the house. Yeah, condition here. Okay, items. Life ring. Character status. You will regenerate one hit point every time you wear it. So it's not overpowered. It affects the entire party too.
I gotta make this an increase in bail too, but I don't think I want to do that right now. As for uh, variables. Yep, everything looks fine to me. Let's see here, fine. Cool events, special, let's make another special comment event. We could have a visual hit point meter, but I don't know how to do that very well. Let's go to layout tools. And uh, go to frame game effects, menus, source, panel, systems, systems, whatever I want to say. Frame game effects. Let's play back. We can put, we could, ah, I can't word. We could add one. And let's see here, conversations, messages. Looks pretty good. Yeah, everything looks good for now. We're not gonna mess around with this. Let's give this game a test. We'll have the old man sell the life ring. And then Standard garb. Life ring will be about 100 and uh, 20 points. And it will cause the effect regenerate hit points to regenerate your hit points. Well, that is it's just a common event. You can make any common event you want. So let's make a common event. Yeah, like a money and possession display variable. Let's display a variable. Let's have a variable called found potatoes. If you find a potato, you will gain one <laughs> one point. Potatoes won't do anything in the game. They'll just leave like a little fun thing you can find in the game. Kitchen. No, that's not it. Kitchen. Food. Potato. You find the potato. Yes, you find it. We'll just add this little potato right about here. And uh, we'll make it a little bigger so you can actually see it. And when you interact with it, you gain one potato point. I don't know why, but <laughs> why not, right? Mm. Okay, conversations. You found one potato. Add this to the variable. Potatoes. Okay. One potato. One. There we go. And if your potato counts higher than one, there the box. Potatoes, potatoes, greater or equal to, the potato shall vanish, never to be seen again. Potatoes will be just be an optional thing you can find. It won't be all that important. 
Let's give this a test play and see what happens. You don't have any potatoes. You must find a potato of power. I want some potatoes, said the stew. I can't seem to get it right now, but that's alright. We'll work on that a little bit later. Old man, let me buy things from you. Now I'm in tune. Let's go find some money. It's gonna get an apple, but that's not a big deal right now. Now we need a weapon in order to go to the house. Healy mushroom just in case, and let's equip our stuff. Magical battle of epic killing! I win! <laughs> Why? Why must I implode? I don't know, because it's funny. Okay, we got that all set. She did just up some vanishes like that too, apparently. Okay, that should do it. We have more incentive to explore this place. Potatoes won't really have much of a purpose right now, but that's okay. I'm just doing it for, for testing purposes, you know? Well, we're done. That's all we got. But we can add some more maps. So let's do that. Let's add a map. Come out. 15, 15. 15. We'll call this living room. We make that 12 by 12 actually. There we go. Okay, we'll make this uh, big. Because I like big maps. Can I lie? I didn't think I did that wrong. Oh well, I'm creative. All right, let's make the floor. Make the floor, mamma mia. Color in the floor. Yes, we color in the floor. Take out the random mistakes right here. Black four. 
color this in with the darkness in my mind. Okay, raise up the flare. I mean, walls. Alright, there we go. One wall, two walls, three walls, four walls, high wall, low wall, mini wall. Oops. Oopsie poopsie. Now let me uh one that you can explore right here, but you don't know that yet. Explore the room. Maybe later. What can we add right here? Modern city indoor objects. Yes, yes, should be to be shared. Okay, need to turn modern city indoor. Be a little more modern, you know. The kids love modern stuff, right? I don't know. I'm not a child. They have all the comforts of home, including a computer. Probably. And a chair. This family is very modern, but they don't even have a dining room table. Oh, wait, yes, they do. I'm going to call it Steve Dining Room Table. Yeah, a little living room right here. <clears throat> Rotate it a little bit. Uh, throw it. Probably not the best way to put a chair right there, but let's say this family uh, had a bit of a run-in with a pack rat. They were the pack rats. Because they left the house rather suddenly. Remember, this is your story. You can make it as, as crazy as you want it to. Need a washer machine, because why not? You need a washer machine. We shall call it washing. Because I wish I could name my things. Then we need a wall. Where can we have a wall? Where do you see a wall? It shall be named Washer, the washing machine. Seriously, this is going to be so sweet, you guys. It'll be so, so special, so cool. Said nobody ever. I don't know what I'm doing with my RPG games. I'm just making them for fun, really. I'm just like, I think I'll make an RPG about a duck named Steven. Yes, because why not? That'd be a dang good RPG right there. You'd have, like, a shotgun. It goes around beating up evil people with guns and destruction and killing. You wish the couch. You don't have a TV because you don't believe in TVs. Because we have time to watch TVs, you know? And we need some dinner. Because you can't have a dining room table without dinner, you know? This is Mr. Blinky Bald Man. He's so slimy with his foreheads. Yes, yes, he is. And they have random boxes all over the place because they're such hoarders. Frankie's being such a pain in the ass. Look, a plate full of potatoes. Doesn't that just make your tummy happy? They're strictly vegetarians. Although they do eat bread sometimes. Because bread is good for you. Well, in moderation, of course. You can't eat too much bread. You get the poopers. They also eat carrots. I don't know why, but why not? I don't like carrots. They're just so delicious. Yes. Yes, they're going carrots. 
Well, they're eating healthy at least. <laughs> it's back here, like, oh, why is there why is like a random carrot right here? Oh, well. <laughs> they need to eat more healthier stuff, you know? Uh, Frankie is being such a dumbass. But she's a dog, she's annoying better. Then we start adding Baba. Because Baba's so cool, you know? She's like the coolest teddy bear ever. She can transform into anything. And she has a shotgun of love. If she shot you in the face with a shotgun, you die painfully, yes. Yes, you shall. Now, we do need a magical item to defeat the ghost. Now, what can we add? A crucifix. What do you guys say? Yes, add it, Raymond. I mean, patchwork. Right here, and there should be a crucifix of coolness. This game is going to be very long, but it will have some uh, variants. That'd be the Holy Bell of uh, Galveston Bay. Yeah, there we go. Or the Cup of Love. Let's see here, a yeah, crucifix looking thing. Alright. We'll call it the Chalice of Power. Defeats all ghosts. Sacred Chalice of Power. Defeats ghosts. <laughs> the face ghosts, batteries not included. It cannot be for sale. I only have one. Okay. That's not it. That's what will just heal you. We'll just make it raise attack power. We'll just heal you for 999 damage. Heals the party all injuries and debuffs. There we go. <clears throat> now we will make some skills. Let's go to this one. Guarding Aura.
characters. Where's my third character at? There we go. To us about 15 MP deck views, and uh, there we go. Shiny Moon is about roughly 10% of your hit points. Sorry, 15%. Went to 25. Slab of Tepigon does damage to all enemies. Uh, Frankie needs to learn how to shut up. And there we go. We have um, a basic amount of characters. We'll add some characters right now as a party member. We'll add Timothy. The raises maximum MP about 16, maximum power 8, 5, 16, 11, that's fine, 1. He has 25 hit points, so far lesser than uh, Stu. Stu is a maximum MP is going to be about 14. Type power 12, defensive power 9, 6, 
11. And he resists poison damage. Scalar's resistance is 5. Poison resistance is 2. Sleep resistance is 11. He is insomnia. Paralysis is resistance 14. Confusion resistance 6. Charm resistance 2. And less HP resistance 1. Timothy has 5. 9, 15, 8, 9, and 1. This guy has 25, 7. Well, like Grandpa is a main character too. He has skills of skills. There we go. And one more. <laughs> Boat. His name is Boat. And that's all we need for now. We'll have a we'll start off with a full party with a game definition. Starting settings. Boat. Grandpa. And Timothy. Okay, we got we got my characters in our care in our, in our party. Let's begin, shall we? Yeah, Grandpa doesn't understand why I'm going with you. I don't understand either why you're going with me, Grandpa. But don't worry about it. Yeah, but I want to eat delicious potato salad. Grandpa, you can't eat potato salad. You don't have teeth anymore. Yeah, shut your face, old little boy. Hey, why do we have a cat? Meow. No, I'm not questioning you. I'm just questioning why you are with us. I want bananas. Grandpa, you can't have bananas anymore. Hey, who asked you, you little hooligan? Who's that cat woman over there? I don't know her. Is she a banana? I want grapefruit now. Grandpa, you can't have grapefruit. Who's that handsome guy? Dirt bike, shotgun, mama. What? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just saying random things. I'm just hungry. Grandpa, you need to stop eating so much. Yeah, Grandpa eats whatever he wants. He'll even eat flesh off the bone. 
Grandpa, stop that. That's disturbing. Yeah, I will kill you. Why is there water coming from your head? I don't know. Yeah, where did that gas man? This is pretty good. We knock him out. Let's equip our stuff now. Why do you get the old bone? Because he said so, okay? Now. No, I'm not being unfair. Apparently, we need more armor. Yes, Grandpa, I know. We need more mushroom stew. I want mushroom stew. I know you do. Okay, good. Ivanushka. Let's talk to the cat and save our progress. How do you save your progress with a cat? Don't ask questions, okay, Grandpa? Yeah, where are we going now? Inside the house. No, I don't want to go in there. It's scary. Well, too bad. But Grandpa is afraid. Oh, this isn't so bad. You play some music for Grandpa. I don't want to play no music. God, Grandpa, you're always so pushy. Let's just save our progress one more time. Are we hurting her? I'm, I'm okay. Let's make a warp point to go over here. And uh, let's see here. It's a bit sparkle. Searchable. Okay, you get the chalice of power. And um, you can also get the joke item, Baba. She doesn't do it much, but she'll be a good armor to have. She'll actually be a very powerful weapon.
Okay, one more weapon. Pick up weapons. And there we go for now.